Ahead of the consecration ceremony in Ayodhya on uh, the 22nd of January, chaos has erupted within the opposition bloc on their stance on the Ram Temple celebrations. Karnataka Deputy Chief Minister D.K. Shiv Kumar defended the government, I beg your pardon, the Congress, Congress government's decision to organize a special puja in 34,000 state-owned temples to mark the ceremony. He said, and I quote, Ultimately, we are Hindus and no religion or symbol belongs to any one individual. However, West Bengal uh, Congress President Adhiranjan Chaudhary has slammed the BJP and said that the Prime Minister is trying to take all credit to himself. He also stated that the history of Ram Temple is ancient and several veterans have contributed to it. But Prime Minister Modi is not mentioning anybody's name to boost his name. On the other hand, West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee has called the temple inauguration a poll gimmick. The chief of the Tinamool Congress Party stated that she does not support festivities that exclude other communities. Chaos has also erupted in the opposition alliance bloc over difference in stance over the temple inauguration. Jay Prakash, my colleague is joining us on the broadcast to talk more about this. Jay Prakash, perhaps what this could be considered as, as a, you know, a good flashpoint for the India bloc to target the central government right before the Lok Sabha elections. Well, that's right, Vineet. We have seen how, uh, you know, the India bloc uh, leaders have been differing with each other, each one having their own being as far as uh, the Shilanyas of uh, uh, Ram Lala at uh, Ayodhya is concerned. Just uh, a few days to go for uh, the uh, uh, installation of uh, the idol at uh, the Ayodhya and the grand inauguration of the temple. Uh, we have seen how, uh, you know, even in Karnataka uh, too, uh, while Sidramaya was uh, uh, holding a different stand uh, that, uh, you know, he never encouraged the building of Ayodhya by demolishing a mosque. He would have given money from the government if uh, uh, the trust was building Ram Temple elsewhere. Uh, uh, statements coming from Deputy Chief Minister D.K. Kumar uh, about uh, the special pujas being held at all the... Uh, department run temples, which is all the temples across Karnataka which are under the control of the Karnataka government. Uh, Ramalingradi, who is also transport and Muzrai minister, has initiated the special puja. Uh, two days ago, he said uh, that uh, he is uh, uh, issued notification that uh, all the pujaris or the pandits should hold special puja on 22nd uh, when the Ramjan Bhumi uh, inauguration takes place uh, in Ayodhya. Uh, and, uh, you know, uh, continuing to support uh, uh, the stand by Ramling Reddy, uh, Deputy Chief Minister D.K. Shukumar has said that what's wrong with this move? I am a Hindu, I am practicing Hindu. Uh, each one has his, uh, can, can uh, you know, he has his own right to practice his own religion. Uh, and as far as uh, uh, celebrating the uh, festival is concerned, uh, the Ram festival on 22nd, uh, there is strictures that uh, the government-run temple should uh, uh, hold special pujas with it. And uh, uh, participating in Ayodhya is a call that should be taken by the AICC. And uh, in the same breath said that let the ASCC decide what they want to do about uh, attending or not attending the program in Ayodhya. But uh, as a Hindu, it's a very sacred day for me because uh, the Ram Idol is being installed in Ayodhya, the birthplace, and uh, I support this completely. Now, uh, be it Udani, the Stalin, Stalin himself, or the TMC, uh, or Adirandan Chaudhary, who is also the leader of opposition uh, from the Congress party, all holding different opinions, uh, but, uh, you know, opinion coming from D.K. Shukumar uh, is in stark contrast of the narrative around the Congress party. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.